Yo, what's up, yo, what's up, everybody? It's your dude, your rebel, yo, guys. Steps to the next level. King Sergeant, aka Lord that too. Same what's up here for Key Clip 346. Here with the third local artist of the St. Louis series. If you don't mind, show the world what your name is, bro. I'm Cole Jack YSD. You're at Sunny's right now. Show them, show them you've seen. You're at Sunny's bar right now in Overland for the coffin release show. It's a bunch of gang gang shit right now. <laughs> yes, my boy Cole Jack here, one of the one of the other local artists. Uh, if you guys remember, in the last few videos, we had uh, Weird Jesus, Weird Jesus, and Gas Machine, and this one of the other guys that performed at a show uh, back a while ago at the Firebird. It was a Gas Machine release, uh, smoking with Tommy Pickles. So we're here for Cole Jack, you know, kind of see what he's all about. So first off, my man, I want to take the time to thank you. So, they what you do for your fam. Now, first off, the name Cole Jack. How you get that? All right. So Cole Jack is just literally my name, Cole Jacob. My full name's Cole Jacob Moltenberg. I hate my last name. You know how it goes. I mean, come on. I mean, the, and, and not to be offensive, but like, you know, whatever last name you got is gonna be doable. Like, I'm sorry. See, it's. My name is so unique, but it just sounds like Morgan. <laughs> like if you like one of the international dudes, you know, it probably fit well. It's like, hey, you know what? Last name's last name. Now, how long and what kind of guy you gone to the rap scene or whatever music that you did? I've been uh, I've been in the music hardcore since probably like my first day of middle school. I started playing drums. Uh, started bullshitly playing guitar, you know, the best I could. And just uh, started listening to like hardcore music like Suicide Silence, oh. like Behemoth. Yeah. Alright, we got the metal man over you here. So, you, so you've been kind of around like different instruments, kind of seeing oh, yeah. what's your style out here. And, oh, yeah. and so as far as you bringing on the mic and just rapping, like what influenced you for rapping? I got I got to rap because uh, like I've always used music for an outlet for myself and uh, you know life happens I end up losing like all my instruments I had like drum sets all that I had like an acoustic guitar I could barely play so I then just decided like I could try writing like song structure and all that and they just kind of stuck and uh, like I've had projects before like trying to be a drummer for bands and stuff that you know never got past like a show. And uh, I'm just, I'm proud. I'm so proud. I never thought I'd be like the person up front, like actually with the microphone. Like anxiety, you know. Well, you know what I mean? Like I say, you know, it takes time, you know, to kind of really get out there, show your stuff, and you know, just like, just lay out the bars. You, and like, you, uh, you do gotta prove yourself. Like, and, and like, and how many venues have you done so far as far as being cold jam? Oh man, okay. Um, I've done Foo Bar both sides, I've done Firebird, I've done Pops both sides, uh, Sunny's multiple times, and Sports Watch Bar and Grill in Denver, Colorado. Really? Really, yeah, that was, I actually uh, opened up for Zeus Rebel Waters, who's in here somewhere. Yeah, I mean, yeah. you've, been, you've been around, you know, around locally and also out of state. Like, dude, you actually been out there. Yeah, that, actually, uh, me and me and Noah went together. Uh, he he was my partner. I was going to go alone, and he literally was like... Which is our cameraman, by the way. Thank you, Noah. Hey, yeah, let's go. <laughs> man, so like... All right, go, go ahead, man. Go ahead, man. Oh, I just, I wouldn't have been able to gotten through that trip. We literally went a day, like, got there, like, our flight left, like, 8 o'clock in the morning. We got there, played the show that night. Our flight back was 5 in the morning, the next morning. So we literally <laughs> flew out, did our thing, and came back, and I would not have been able to fucking get through it if it wasn't for Noah. He really, like, he kept me living. <laughs> we got it's, it's stupid high. <laughs> <laughs> and, I, and I gotta say, like, you know, uh, you were really pushing through, you know, just making your name out there for yourself. And like, what what really gets you going? Like, most of your songs, does it relate to anything or is it free, like freelance? What, what, okay, so all my songs for the most part, like, you know, I, I deal with like depression. I'm like, uh, you know, I got my issues, and all the songs come from those like those places of like, you know deep emotion like those dark places and uh really at the beginning about like the first year because i was writing i was doing this like building up this whole jack name for about like nine months before i even got booked for the show um 
what was just pushing me through there was just like the thought of like maybe writing about these desolate places maybe somebody can relate that that's what kept me pushing to keep doing it like the thought of maybe somebody can relate and since doing it i've talk I've met to plenty of people that have like had really heartfelt discussions with me about like what it meant to them and honestly they're the ones that keep me pushing this you know this is a hero right here this is a definite hero right here so it's basically just your whole life in song life and just writing and you know that's that was kind of my point of like the whole jack name because I, I might as well tell this one. When I started writing, I like wanted to do like the little dicky shit. And I just like made joke raps. So I made a joke rap moniker name. I did that for about a week. And then I was like, I need to be serious and have an actual outlet. So I came up with like the Cole Jack name, Cole Jacob. But like I wanted to start something that could be like I could bring my friends in and I could like, you know, use for someone not just me. So I like kept the anagram for the joke name and I threw it on the and the cold jack. It's YSD. YSD stands for young skinny dickless. <laughs> And I like that. I definitely love that, man. And it's all freestyle. Here. It is. And you know, it, it's also just like, at the very beginning, it was kind of like, because I knew, like, I, I come from a cornfield town. Like, kids make fun of me different. I knew they fucking, you know how it goes. So, like, part of me naming myself YSD was like, whatever joke hate I get, they don't even get the joke. Yo, it's a dude. Eight six, bro. Eight six. Dude. It's a dude. Right on. All right, but like I said, I mean, I'm actually getting. You know, you you you've been through a lot. You came through. You know, no matter what, and you are just making an impact. You know, I'm proud of you, man. I'm very very proud of you. Man. Thank you so much. Man. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best. That's all anyone can do. Hey, bar stuff like I say, I want to thank you for doing the interview, my man. It's been awesome. Now, uh, also, where can we find it? First of all, do you want to give any, uh, any shout outs? Okay, yeah. So, shout out, Agitate the Airwaves and Travis. Much love. Shout out, Sonny's and James. Sonny's Bar in Overland, Missouri. Shout out, Frost Money. Shout out, everybody that's here right now. 8 6 Family, Rebel Gang. Goddamn. I'm amazed at, at everyone that's here right now, honestly. Now, where can we find Cold Jack? Where, where, where's all the social media, all the music, where can we find you at? Oh, shout out Frost Money too. That was my last one. Uh, I just dropped my album Coffin on my SoundCloud, just Cold Jack YC. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram. Uh, Twitter, all Cole Jack YSD. We got a Facebook page for uh, the YSD, for all of us, for Hayon, for Weird Jesus, for That Place is Haunted, for the whole collective. Find us everywhere. We're, we're all around. We're all around. I'm always shit posting. <laughs> well, that is Cole Jack, ladies and gentlemen. D, one of the youngest uh, St. Louis artists here. So check him out. Also, like I said, we're going to be going here in a minute. But in the meantime, follow him on all his music. You know, it is legit. Check it out. Also, you know, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and TikTok for me. So, y'all know the deal. Stay tuned for 347. I'll see you when I see y'all. Peace out. Stay awesome. Live. Yay! All right.